All right, guys, what is up, man? We are lit, boy. We in this thing, man. Welcome to the final part of the campaign. Now, I've already finished it. Now, I'm making this intro after I've finished the game and I have viewed all three endings. So, you can get a total of three endings. And probably, um, from my understanding, literally the choices you make throughout the campaign don't really matter because the choices you make at the end will allow you to choose which ending that you want. So I want to appreciate you guys for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy this series. If you guys would like me to play the other endings, I will be more than happy to do so. But like I said, they're already online um, and you could just see it real quickly. But for now, let's go ahead and enjoy the end of this campaign. Hope you guys enjoyed once again. And let's do it. He's coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? Oh, all right. What, what's happening to me? What you're going through now is nothing compared to what you'll experience if you don't start cooperating. So Bell was out. We don't know who. Uh... We gave you a second chance when you were shit out of luck. Now we just want some assistance in return. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. His associate Arash Kardavar turned on you at the airstrip in Turkey. Left you for dead. Oh, that was okay. So if you guys remember at the beginning of the game when we took down that big plane. Like that, Bell was one of the guys that got shot. <laughs> sobbing in Duva. This you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duva alive. We'll dump their bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of you. I don't want the competition. Dang. And he still got on the same clothes. We were there. <laughs> we found you after everything went down. The CIA reinvented you, Bell. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old. Sims and I both wanted you to be CIA. You didn't resist it as much as we thought you might. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. The CIA's MK Ultra program used Atlas missions in Vietnam as a template. We needed you to have that shared experience, that lifelong bond, to establish trust. So we were never in Vietnam? No. Count yourself lucky. You've only had those memories for a few months. Me? I've been living with them for over a decade. Dang. Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. <laughs> so you could clearly go the opposite direction, but I just kind of want to get the best ending, what I, at least what I think is the best today, ending. We're not finished yet. We have a job to do. Bell, we've got a job. You've got a job to do. You've got a job to do. The trigger phrase kept you in line, but it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind a door. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now, what we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you, it's about millions of other fucking people. 
He got a feline shirt on. It's about stopping someone who, in the end, has no true allegiance to anyone other than itself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the green stars, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovets. This is your chance to find him. Solovetsky. Where is Perseus? He's in Solovetsky. From the safety of Solovetsky. Solovetsky. Oh, so you can go truth or lie. Obviously, we're going to tell the truth. Solovetsky. Sims, get Washington on the line. Everyone else, gear up. We're leaving now. Thank you, sir. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on. You're still one of us. Hey, he turned on me, dog. Alright, so I don't think it's over. Because there's three different endings, so... I mean, obviously the game's not over, but I don't think making the choices Versus, are over. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. You've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. We are hours away from Perseus detonating nuclear bombs in every major European city. We'll do whatever it takes. Some of us have crossed the line. To make sure the line's still there in the morning. What? No one's gonna brand us heroes or villains. So like Transformers? Y'all remember Transformers? They don't know us. As for me, I've been chasing this ghost for 13 years. The first Transformers when they was gearing up. So how that big fight? <laughs> that was so fire. That ends now. we go all his face isn't loaded that's disgusting Get to use it that much. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's get out. <clears throat> what they got? XM4. All right, let's get it. I don't think we had this in the campaign yet. Oh yeah. Hey, I ain't played in a day. Feel like I ain't played it forever. How we get somebody off that AA gun? Got him. 
Oh yeah. And Hudson was doubting Bell, man. I knew I'd come through. Alright, here we go. Reload. We got one AA clear. You know that's not good enough. I can't risk an early strike. We only got one shot at this. All right, I'm on you. I know that. Just be ready to launch when I tell you, Hudson. Contact. No, he did. A chi chi. Chi chi. Got him. Oh, headshot. Kill the Soviet heavy. Uh oh. Thank you. Come on now. Got him. Tow him up. God. Oh, yeah. Shotgun for the win. Yes, yeah, sir. What we got what we got that's a big gamble if that gun ain't clear oh rpd dang i'm really liking that m4 but let's do it copy that get your team out of there adler those bombers won't have a chance if we don't clear that last aa gun you better hurry the fuck up got him hey we gotta move Boy, you gotta love the 200 round. Golly. Look at that reload, RS-125. Oh, I need it. They should've gave me some uh, armor. Oh yeah, I'm trying to move. Boom, I'm trying to move, what the Yeah. Yes, sir. All right, I'm leaving. We gotta go now. Oh, let me move. Oh, Didn't let me move. Did I die? Not Bell. They did it, Mr. President. They stopped the nukes. Thank God. And the CIA. Did they get Perseus? No, sir. His whereabouts are unknown. And a Russian response? Nothing yet. We're seeing signs of confusion. It's possible this was all a rogue operation. Perseus may not have been following orders from Moscow. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe we have something in common after all. My hand, Bell. We did it. This is a message to Perseus and those that'll follow him. We don't just sit back and hope for the best. We'll make the best happen. This is how wars are won, Bell. Do you have an update on Kasim Javadi? Yeah, after capturing Kasim Javadi, we've convinced him he's better off working for us rather than against us. The death of Arash Kadavar opens a path for Kasim to take control of their network. He'll give us deeper insight into Soviet activity in the Middle East. And with our resources behind him, he should be able to influence regional affairs for years to come. I think this is where everything comes together, all your choices. What about Anton Volkov? Volkov has become a prime source of information since his capture. After interrogating him, MI6 quickly established a series of listening posts in East Berlin. 
They've already intercepted messages from the KGB to assets throughout the city. We're poking holes in the Iron Curtain. How did the cleanup in Havana go? We were able to recover Agent Azalea's body from the compound in Cuba. President Reagan personally reached out to his family and his caskets in transit to Tel Aviv. As you know, Helen Park returned to London. She'll continue to recover from her injuries there. Afterwards, MI6 plans to give her a task force dedicated to finding Perseus. What about the rest of the team? They got off Solovetsky before the Soviets could send in forces to investigate. It'll take some time to heal up, then it's back to work. We may have stopped Perseus, but his rats are still nesting all around us, thanks to the help of one of our own. True. We failed to hunt down Robert Aldrich and his domestic network of spies. We may have to go to more extreme measures, like broad domestic surveillance, which of course we're not authorized to do. Not yet. What about Europe? Not only did we stop a nuclear attack, we managed to take out Major Vadim Rudnik. That should be a significant blow to Perseus's European network. We also flushed two of Rudnik's key assets down the shitter. There's one left, and eventually they'll hit the sewer too. Such poetry, Hudson. And Bell. Arctic air. Clears the head, doesn't it? Bell, you made two extraordinary sacrifices to stop Perseus. One was without your knowledge. The other, you made that decision at your own accord. I just want you to know that this little thing that's happened with you and me... It was always for the greater good. You're a goddamn hero, you know that, kid? Heroes have to make sacrifices. That's why when I ask you for one more, I hope you understand. It was never personal. Dang! <laughs> hey, that ending was <laughs> that was clean, though. That was uh, I I wonder what happened. I wonder if somebody got shot. I'm curious to see the different endings myself. So if you guys want to see it on this channel, just let me know. But if not, I'm finna go do the same thing. Y'all probably gonna do and go check out what the other endings are. Uh, I want to appreciate you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it i really like this story um i'll probably do a full review video over the whole game once i get some multiplayer and zombies in but until then i'll catch you guys in the next video